and I learned the hard way. I mean, it was a lot of trial and error, and because uh, it, it, it was again, there were no classes to take, and and that's one of the reasons, you know, when my daughter was really small, that I decided that I need to teach people what how to do this too. Mm -hmm. You know, I've always been a commission artist where people hire you to do something for their home or you know, for maybe for a restaurant or a church or something, but. For the most part, it's for individuals, and so it's only seen by those people. It's very powerful to have community art that many people get to see and engage with. When 9-11 happened, um, there were three kids and teachers that were on the planes that crashed in the Pen Pentagon. So I went to all three of those schools and said, can I work with those kids that lost their teacher and their and their fellow student. And only one of the uh, elementary schools took me up on it. Um, but it was a great project that the kids got to make a couple of stained glass windows for their school. And it had the name of this teacher and student that was lost, but also these very positive um, words incorporated, like adventure, hope, love, you know, a lot. And, and while the kid, some of the kids were working on the stained glass aspect of the thing, uh, the other kids were making little fused glass sun cutters that they could keep and take home with them. 